Professor Stuart Crozier has played a major role in the field of magnetic resonance imaging over the course of 20 years, working not only with industry, but with clinicians and patients. The first of these contributions was the development of patent-protected technology for correction of field shifts caused by pulsed magnetic field gradients. Two things I admire most about Stuart are his versatility, which leads into the innovation, and his determination. Professor Crozier and his team have also played a key role in the development of modern MRI and NMR systems produced and sold by the leading global companies in this field. This contribution is reflected in the 24 patented technologies for which he is listed as an inventor. The devices within an MRI system that cause spatial location were interfering with the quality of the images. Our eureka moment was to realise that we could correct the frequency of the MR signal rather than the magnetic field. And this en enabled us to correct it much more accurately, much more quicker. We can detect smaller disease states earlier and provide better scope to treat them and have more effective healthcare. His contribution has placed the University of Queensland at the forefront of universities globally in US patents awarded in this field. You protect those inventions and companies such as Siemens and GE can come and license it. That then uh, is the best way to get that invention out to patients. It's very rare for an individual to have had such a major impact on a global industry. You know, Stuart's technologies are in two thirds of the world's MRI machines and he's produced a whole new generation of product which is improving healthcare outcomes around the world. Stuart Crozier was the founding scientist of Magnetica Limited, an Australian company focused on developing low-cost MRI systems to improve and increase availability of this technology. So that enables uh, remote hospitals or places in, in the third world that don't have access to very large health budgets to get one of these systems in and to be imaging joints with the uh, highest technology that you would normally expect. The efforts of Professor Crozier and his team in the design of superconducting magnets have resulted in the development of compact, portable MRI scanners that can image the extremities without immersing the whole body in the magnetic field. There's been a lot of interest from around the world with the superconductor technology, uh, which has led to it being manufactured and adopted. It's also encouraged Stuart to look at new and innovative new generation approaches. So it's really opening the doors for this technology to roll out into different environments than it has been before. For example, image-guided therapies uh, is another direction that I think the market is taking in which we will use not only MRI systems to do the diagnosis, but we'll have devices in there that can uh, treat the patient as well. Over 100 units of the extremity scanners, based on the superconducting magnet designs created by Professor Crozier and his team for Magnetica, have now been sold worldwide. And the end game is improving uh, people's health care uh, and the ability to do that through technology. And you need to love uh, working with students and having them graduate through the system. He likes to find and recruit good, talented young people and he mentors them um, using a range of skills, incorporating humour, challenges, personal interactions to really uh, build a bond with them, challenge them and take them forward to reach their potential.